Both Gottfried Wilhelm Leibniz and Sir Isaac Newton credited with the independent and near simultaneous invention of calculus in the late 17th century, but their approaches differed significantly in focus and methodology. Leibniz developed integral calculus first, concentrating on areas under curves, and introduced the modern notation for integration and differentiation, which made his framework more accessible and easier to generalize. In contrast, Newton began with differentiation, focusing on solving problems related to motion and rates of change. His work, deeply tied to physical applications like planetary motion, was more geometrically grounded and lacked the systematic symbolic notation that Leibniz emphasized. Newton referred to his version as the method of fluxions and worked on it as early as 1665 to 1666, though he delayed publication. Meanwhile, Leibniz published his work in 1684, a few years before Newton's contributions became widely known. This overlap sparked a fierce priority dispute. But while both are recognized as co-creators of calculus, Leibniz's notation and systematic approach have had a more lasting influence on modern mathematics.